feel like you guys getting a little respect now with uh, being picked preseason number one in the conference with how this team started when Coach Hatcher first got here till now. Is that gratifying? Does that kind of make it, I don't know, put it into perspective of how far you guys have come, what you've accomplished? Yeah, it has. Um, it's, been, it's really gratifying knowing from coming in freshman year, being a good, good team, having a winning record, but kind of being on that, you know, six and five record standpoint. Now finishing last year at eight and two, um, it just, it's just great to see us, you know, continue to win more games each year. And uh, like Coach said, hopefully if we can win one, one or two more games, then we'll have that SoCon title and then we'll go far in the playoffs. So we're excited. With going back-to-back -back playoff appearances and it kind of ending there, has that motivated you guys? I mean, I know losing in the playoffs one year kind of motivates, but back-to-back -back years has got to be kind of tough. Yeah, um, it has been, especially because last year we were favorited and uh, – we, and we lost, you know, same spot as we did the year before. But, I mean, I, it, it's really just, it, it's, I think this year, this upcoming year, it's going to be a lot different because, like we said, if we do win that one more game and we do win that SOCON title going into the playoffs, we'll have that bye, and then we'll just keep winning and hopefully make a long playoff run. So, When you got guys like you do on the offense who are putting up the huge stats and scoring the points, a lot of people kind of overlook the defense. How good can this defense be? <laughs> well, our defense is going up against our offense every single day, which helps us a ton. I mean, playing linebacker and being up against um, six, uh, KJ and Seashell, playing man on them almost every day is one of the hardest things to do. Um, so really playing against them every single day is, is a challenge, and that sets us up for game week because whenever we play an, an opposing offense, I mean, we're, we're very ready for them because our offense is so dominant. a couple pieces on that defense uh, what I guess what pressure does that put on you guys to kind of fill into those shoes and do you see it as pressure do you have to think about oh I got to be the one to step up or is it something that just naturally happens it's it's more of a I've been prepared for it um, you ask Ahmad the same thing he's been prepared for it the past few years uh, now that we're seniors like we lost Shahid Salmon last year he's one of our vocal leaders um, big guy on the defense and just being being able to watch him for the past three years and now being a senior has really helped prepare me to you know kind of be a vocal guy and um, know the defense and some of these young guys who don't know the defense as well kind of put them in their place and and um, just encourage them to keep learning and getting better um, but really I mean we did lose a we did lose a few key pieces but uh, we got some young guys that will step up for sure and I think this year our defense is going to be even better than last year so going into your senior year and you've seen this thing kind of come full circle from where it was before till now what would it mean for you and the senior class to leave with that SOCON title something that hasn't been done here in a while I mean it was uh, a few months ago we were all up in this room all the seniors we had a senior breakfast and we kind of stood up and and we were talking about our goals this year and what, what, what we want to happen and um, we made a promise to ourselves all the seniors stood up we made a promise to ourselves that we're not going to go out without this ring, without this SoCon championship. So um, that's what we're going for. That's our goal, and we're going to settle for nothing less.